Whether you're pleased to witness a tiger or ecstatic to view the endangered great Indian bustard, these incredible yet little-known wildlife destinations beautifully embrace the rich diverse biodiversity. Let's have a look at some of the world's lesser-known wildlife destinations and see what makes them so intriguing and adventurous. Elephants are impressive in any setting, but seeing them in Medikwe Game Reserve, home to South Africa's red elephants, is particularly memorable. Meet elephants that have adapted to the forbidding environment of the country's northwest, where the giants coat themselves in red clay, as a cooling mechanism, at Matia Safari Lodge. The Galapagos Islands, located in the Pacific Ocean, more than 500 nautical miles west of Ecuador, are a living museum of evolutionary biology where the land before time exists in the present. The Galapagos giant tortoise, the world's largest living species of tortoise, roams this Darwinian dreamland. The archipelago is known for its diverse wildlife. Its enormous tortoises are estimated to have some of the longest life spans of any organism on the planet up to 150 years. The Galapagos animal's remarkable resemblance to South and Central American fauna suggests that most of the island's species originated there. Today, the islands are home to a diverse spectrum of subspecies because of evolutionary adaptations. Every year, millions of wildebeests migrate between Tanzania's Serengeti National Park and Kenya's Masai Mara National Reserve in pursuit of rich meadows. It's all about timing when it comes to capturing this inspiring and dramatic show. From July to October, stay at Governor's Camp to see the wildebeest migration, into and out of the Mara. From December to April, head to the southern Serengeti, and stay at and beyond Serengeti under canvas to see carving season. A hot air balloon safari is the best way to get the best view of the migration. Atlantic puffins, the iconic, clown-faced birds were declared locally extinct in Maine, the United States in 1901, but because of the life work of Dr. Stephen W. Cress and big contributors like Barbara's, maker of Puffin Cereal, they have made a tremendous recovery. Dr. Cress Project Puffin has spawned a seasonal bird-watching economy with boat trips to Eastern Egg Rock, the project's bird refuge. You'll need to contribute a significant fee to the initiative to obtain access to the island by foot, following which Dr. Cress will likely personally guide you to witness his Audubon-affiliated life's work. In Tanzania and Botswana, Here's a pro tip for spotting lions, instead of visiting national parks, travel to more isolated lodges on private concessions, where off-roading and night driving are permitted, and the number of cars is limited to the number of guests on the site. Finding a colossal herd, or crash in safari lingo, and being entertained for hours with highly photogenic hippo shenanigans, fighting, snuggling, bobbing, territory marking, which includes whipping the tail in a helicopter-like fashion, and herding in almost artistic formations are all common sightings on an African safari. For example, at and beyond Klein's camp in Tanzania and wilderness safaris Vambura Plains camp in Botswana, you're likely to have hours-long experiences, with massive pride of lions, not just one single female, and not just for a fast five minutes without seeing another vehicle. Sharby Sand Game Reserve, west of Kruger National Park, and beyond Finder Private Game Reserve, a 100-square-mile tract of South Africa's KwaZulu-Natal region, are home to the critically endangered black or hook lip, thanks to dedicated conservation efforts. Although the Masai Mara National Reserve in Kenya is a refuge for big cats, you're more likely to acquire those treasured cheetah photos in South Africa as a safari-goer and beyond Finder Private Game Reserve is located on Prime Cheetah Territory, so you can see and photograph them. With all the bad news about melting ice caps and starving polar bears, it's heartening to discover that one polar bear subpopulation, as well as its natural surroundings, is prospering. Welcome to the West Hudson Bay coast of Canada, where approximately 1,000 plump polar bears call home. When whale watching off the coast of Puerto Adolfo Lopez Mateos in Magdalena Bay, Mexico, don't bring your zoom lens. The grey whales here approach small skiffs with ease, 
popping in and out of the water at close range to examine the sight of or struck humans shooting photos at breakneck speed. While the semi-acclimatized tigers of Ranthambore National Park in northern India are easier to photograph, head to Madhya Pradesh in central India to photograph the elusive, wild tigers in a more natural setting. Prepare to photograph curious longors, peacocks in full bloom, multicolored Indian rollers, and, of course, beautiful Bengal tigers as you check into Taj Safari's Banjar Tola on the riverbanks next to Konha National Park. At Rwandan Mountain, experience getting up close and personal with a mountain gorilla, a creature with 97% of human DNA, which is probably the ultimate wildlife encounter. You can observe them up close in the mists of Rwanda's lush, hilly north, with all the excitement and awe that such an encounter will bring. Begin your vacation by securing a coveted national park permit, from your preferred outfitter or lodge, the permits are sometimes sold out months in advance. Leopards are notoriously elusive and difficult to notice, but leopards are more common than not in the Okavango Delta. At Wilderness Safaris Abu Camp and Vambura Plains Camp, sightings are usually exceptional. Venture into the undergrowth of Yala National Park on the island of Sri Lanka in search of the Sri Lankan leopard, the smaller cousin of the African leopard. Yala has one of the highest densities of leopards in the world, and it provides an alternative to the traditional African safari. We no longer need to travel to South Africa for amazing encounters with the ocean's most fascinating and feared animal, which is the great white shark, thanks to a massive rebound in the grey seal population off Massachusetts coast. This supreme predator has steadily returned to its former home along the Cape, thanks to an abundance of prey. Take part in scientific research, and get incredibly close to these misunderstood creatures with the Atlantic White Shark Conservancy, which conducts a program to shadow shark researchers, as they tag and identify the great whites. Panthero Leo white lions are a genetic oddity found only in eastern South Africa's Kruger National Park. Unfortunately, their great beauty has been a curse, as all but 13 individuals have been taken from the wild for circuses, zoos, Las Vegas shows, and hunting. Surprisingly, this ultra-rare big cat can still be seen in its natural habitat. Singita Libombo Lodge and Singita Sweeney Lodge, located near the South African Mozambique border, have exclusive access to a 33,000-acre section of Kruger National Park, where some lions have the recessive white gene. A white male cub was born last year, and he's been routinely seen, and photographed on game drives ever since. That is all about places to see wildlife. Do like, comment, share, and subscribe to our channel, Explified.